ni más que no amanezca y que se haga a medianoche. Cancun is one of the 31 states in the Republic of Mexico and it is located at the far southeast section of the Yucatan Peninsula and is bordered with the Mexican Gulf and Caribbean Sea. Cancun was established as a new resort for the foreign tourists about 36 years ago with the help of foreign investors and Mexican government. Thousands of acres of snake infested land had to be cleared before any building could be erected. The result was a fantastic mixture of technology and beautiful buildings and fine weather which provides year in year out beautiful scenery uh, for all the visitors. Yucatan Peninsula was a main domain of the Mayan Empire which was established about 900 AD. The airport is about 15 kilometers to the center of the town and the main hotel row is situated at Kukalkans Boulevard which is 11 kilometers long and consists of over 110 beautiful hotels. Majority of the hotels can be booked as inclusive to include food, liquor and entertainment. Beaches of Cancun has a white creamy sand which stays clean and combed every night. Lush trees and lovely pools provide fabulous sceneries. 24 hours uh, swimming pool creates an opportunity for the guests to relax and forget about the outside world. Nightly entertainment are provided by most of the hotels and the famous show troops, especially the Cuban musicians and dancers are doing a great, great job. Transportation is plenty and taxis are very reasonable and usually it costs about $10 from hotel to the town or 70 cents with the public bus transportation. Mexico lacks the train services but it has one of the best bus services in the world. Hospitality industry provides plenty of jobs for half a million population in Cancun. Almost all of the fr frontline workers speak English. The handcraft market provides a beautiful and inexpensive gifts and souvenirs to the public. Mayan girls of all kind can sell handicraft in the street. Hotel provides food quality buffet for breakfast, lunch and dinner, an option to the specialty restaurant. Pools provide snack bars and front ocean view uh, for a great place to, uh, to rest. Cancun offers many sightseeing. Uh, such as Mayans Pyramid, Exha, a beautiful nature cruise, a snorkeling on the reef, trip to Isla Mujeres, which is about five miles away from Cancun, or uh, spend an evening in a sailing ship th that includes a lobster dinner for about $60. A tour of Mayan pyramids is a must and costs about $80. Fabulous food on a breakfast, lunch and dinner can be served on a daily basis. The bus takes about 9 a.m. and continues the route to the state of Yucatan. Mayan's hut can be seen on both sides of the road along with the short trees. Archaeological ruins of the Chichen Itza in the state of Yucatan is only 110 kilometers away from Yucatan. The bus stops at the ancient city of Valladolid, which dates back to 16th century. Here, we can see the real Mayans strolling in their daily lives. Confederation of Mayans has provided a center for a production of silver and papyrus art craft. Tourists can buy silver bracelets with Mamean symbols printed on it. One of the interesting parts of the region is the underground river. Tourists can descend through the deep steps to see the wonder of the land. There is also an interesting hotel in the middle of the jungle designed for people who want to get away from the uh, city life. The hotel provides serene view of the nature and a beautiful and it has no TV or phone services. Bus stops at the village of Blanchet for lunch and tops off with the Mayan folkloric dances. Chichen Itza has been discovered by the German archaeologists about 1940s. Several pyramids and especially the archaeological buildings are very interesting to see. Isla Mujeres Island is about five miles north of Cancun and it is a very interesting place to visit. There is a several ferry boats leaving from the dock to to the island. Upon arrival, 
and to show their warm hospitality, a large group of employees are lined up to greet the guests. There are snorkeling at the reef available for extra charge by the tour operators. Small motorbikes are also available to rent and that you can drive around the island with a guide. Shops full of seashells and handcrafts are on display for sale. Cancun and surrounding area can be seen from the hilltops of Isla Mujeres, which is a fantastic, breathtaking view. The island is a home of wild iguanas who roam around the island on an enclosed area but dine on vegeta vegetables only. Isla Mujeres used to be a destination for the Caribbean pirates in the past, but now it's a beautiful location to visit. Mopeds or taxis can be rented to explore the port. It only takes about less than an hour to ride through all the beautiful old streets and alleys. The town represents a true old Caribbean pirate town. Scuba diving is one of the entertainment which costs about 50 to 60 dollars. Being on the Caribbean Sea, there is always an opportunity for thunderstorm which could flood the streets in a couple of hours and shut down the electricity. Therefore, extra flashlight is always advisable for the tourist. Nightlife in town center starts as early as 4 p.m. Shops are full of handcraft souvenirs and alcoholic beverages which encourages over drinking by the youth, young, young people. Ironically, there is no buildings over 35 years old since the city was recently established. There are more than 700,000 Mayans in Yucatan Peninsula which some of them are employed at the hospitality area. Most hostesses at the restaurants wear beautiful, colorful local dresses which adds to the Mexican flavor. ¡Pasión! 